Sutiloma Sutiloma Sutta Thus have I heard. On one occasion, the Blessed One was dwelling at Gaya, at the Tham Kita bed, the adobe of the Yakka Suchiloma. Now, on that occasion, the Yakka Kara and Yakka Suchiloma passed by not far from the Blessed One. Then the Yakka Kara said to the Yakka Suchiloma, He is an ascetic. He is not an ascetic. He is a sham ascetic. I'll soon find out whether he is an ascetic or a sham ascetic. Then the Yakka Suchiloma approached the Blessed One. Having approached, he leaned towards the Blessed One. The Blessed One drew back. Then the Yakka Suchiloma said to the Blessed One, Are you afraid of me, ascetic? I am not afraid of you, friend. It is just that your touch is bad. I will ask you a question, ascetic. If you won't answer me, I will drive you insane or split your heart and grab you by the feet and hurl you across the Ganges. I do not see anyone in this world, friend, with its devas, Mara and Brahma, in this population, with its ascetics and Brahmins, its devas and humans, who can drive me insane, or split my heart, or grab me by the feet and hurl me across the Ganges. But ask whatever you want, friend. The Yakka Suchiloma then addressed the Blessed One in verse. What is the source of lust and hatred? Where are born discontent, delight and hair-rising terror? Having originated from what do the mind's thoughts toss one around as boys toss up a crow? Lust and hatred have their source here. From this are born discontent, delight and hair-rising terror. Having originated from this, the mind's thoughts toss one around as boys toss up a crow. Born from affection, arisen from oneself, like the trunk-born shoots of the banyan tree, manifold, attached to sensual pleasures, like a malua creeper stretched across the woods. Those who understand their souls they dispel it. Listen, O Yakka. They cross this flood so hard to cross, uncrossed before, for no renewed existence. Mm-hmm.